This question appeared in Tansert 2014, part of the data sufficiency section. Test number 69. In the concept of Andrikana, this is testing mensuration surface area of solids, rectangular solids, other concept. Level of difficulty in the medium. Let's have a look at this question. What is the surface area of the rectangular solid by? Which is what we need to find out. Render statement could the dimensions of one face of the rectangular solid. One face one is 2 by 3. That's statement 1. The area of another face, this is one face of area, 6 square units. This is the rectangular solid order, surface area. Can be right. What we will do is as usual, we will quickly answer some of these questions, get clarity on what the answer is, what the formula is, what the formula is, and when is the data sufficient. Then let's move on to actually evaluating the statements. Right. First one is what kind of an answer will you get? This is a question which is asking you to find out the surface area of a rectangular solid. So, answer one finally should be a number 43 square units, 74 square units. This is a number followed by square units. What is the formula to find out the surface area of a rectangular solid? Let its length be L, let its width be W, and let its height be H. So, length, width, height, that is surface area is going to be equal to 2 times of LW plus wh plus lh so this is going to be the surface area of this edunaran ketona or rectangular solid ingiradhu vandu nam or duster ah paakra mari illati or dabba ah paakra mari or rectangular box ah paakra mari in the l into w ingiradhu vandu bottom area and top area w into h ingiradhu vandu left side area and right side area l into h ingiradhu vandu area of the front face and area of the back face so motta aaru faces irukku this is the surface area. When will we say the data is sufficient? In the many questions, the data is sufficient whenever you are finding a number, when the answer is unique. We have one number, 43 square units, data is sufficient. When is the data not sufficient? Either when you get more than one answer or you do not have the information to find out what is 2 times of LW plus WH plus LH. If you have an answer, but if you have more than one answer, then the data is not sufficient. Let's look at statement 1. Let's evaluate statement 1 alone. Statement 1 is the dimensions of one face is 2 by 3. Right? And approximately, a rectangular solid. In the rectangular solid, one face dimension is 2 by 3. This is 3. This is 2. We will mark it. So, this is how the rectangular solid is going to look. Right. So, we know the two dimensions. We know the two dimensions. What we do not know is, we do not know the third dimension. In the dimension, we will not be able to find out. Right. This is 2 by 2 into 3. In the surface, we have 6 square centimeters. In the top surface, 6 square centimeters. Now, in the width, we have 2. Height is This surface is going to have 8. Height to this will be 20. So, we are not going to get a unique answer without the third dimension. So, statement 1 is not sufficient. Statement 1 sufficient to eliminate the obvious answer choice eliminate 1. We can also eliminate choice 4 because it says each statement is independently sufficient. So, at the end of statement 1, we have narrowed down our answers to 2, 3 or 5. So, if you choice, you have to do 33 percent strike rate. Let's evaluate statement 2 alone. Statement 2 basically says, the area of another face is equal to 6. This is the two dimensions and one face in the first statement. Here is the face of the area of the 6. I will just again quickly plot this diagram to get us an idea about what we are doing. So, in the face, this area of the 6 square units. So, this is R and this is the opposite face of R. Because rectangular solids, the opposite faces or dimensions will always be the same. So, this is... 6 in the front face one is 6 and very back face is 6 in the dimension one in the 6 k 6 into 1 nala 6 are under 2 into 3 nala 6 are under 1.5 into 4 nala 6 are and the third dimension in another area so that the surface area is going to change so statement 2 is also not sufficient you can eliminate what all answer choices here can we have eliminated 1 4 if we are down to 2 3 5 statement 2 was sufficient alena answer choice 2 we eliminate money so, we have shortlisted our answers to 3 or 5. Last step, either when the answer is 3. Either we can tell the answer is 5 is the answer. Let's combine the two statements. Statement 1 is 
essentially said that one of the or a dimension pair of dimensions is equal to 2 1 3 unnonna enna sonna statement 2 la vandu the other face oda area vandu 6 square units appdi irukku essentially net net enna idu vandu or face ku 2 by 3 na idoda area evlo irukum idoda area vandu 6 square units idukku opposite face oda area vandu enna vaadha irukka mudiyum 6 square units avum pudusa edhuvume renda statement la solidilla so idha vachu pa enna kadaisila moona dimension enna ne theriyad third dimension if it is 5 surface area is going to be different third dimension 10 a irundha vera edhava irukku podu so rendu statement seethu potum we have not got an answer so essentially we can eliminate one more answer choice which is choice 3 is also not right so we are down to 5 5 is the correct answer we are looking for classes for tanser we conduct classes at chennai moonu center irukku classes are conducted by tanser toppers anna university graduate i am graduates if you are looking for past year tanset papers, solutions, videos, visit this website that's given. The best way to reach us is at 9600-48484. Reach us on this number. In the video channel is youtube.com slash user Tanset MBA. If you subscribe to this channel, we keep updating solutions to past year papers. If you have previous year Tanset top person, you will have to crack your tips and tricks. Subscribe today, stay updated, it's absolutely free.